Today is May 22nd, 2022, and it is World Goth Day. The way this started, I believe, is because Susie Sue actually released Spellbound, I think, on this day, and after that, it became like a day basically to celebrate. So, I really, well, my last video was the 90s goth makeup tutorial and I'm supposed to be doing 80s next and I don't really want to do 80s today um, because then that would kind of ruin the tutorial for the 80s makeup so I'm just gonna do some dramatic makeup and put together an outfit I saw this person on Pinterest I don't know their account or anything but I really like their outfit and I want to tease my hair to look like that today. I've tried many times in the past before and I just haven't succeeded. My hair does not stay teased. I just think I need to add more hairspray, um, but we'll see. Today I'm going to be wearing my red contacts. You know, for the past like few months I've been wearing the like bluish hazel looking ones. But today I'm going to be wearing the red ones. Okay, here are the contacts in. The primer I've been using recently is the e.l.f. Um, Power Grip Primer. I haven't been using that much of it because it is so sticky, like crazy sticky. But I've just been putting it on my nose and like the areas of my nose because this is where my makeup tends to like come off is my nose. I have really oily skin. Um, I have acne. So I have to start using like mattifying foundation because I've been using really dewy foundations and they don't really work with my skin so I need to start switching it up a little but you already know I always do my face makeup first so I'm just gonna kind of um, speed through this I am going to start listing all of the products I'm using in the description because people ask me all the time what products I'm using and I'm very bad at um, Saying what I'm using when I'm using it so I'm just gonna put it all in the description so if you're curious and you want to know what I'm using I'll just put all the information down there The two palettes I'm using, this is the Revlon or Revolution Reloaded Blackout Palette. I've had this for so long, um, but it just has a bunch of gray tones. I think I'm going to use this one over here in the corner, like just a light, light, light amount of it. And mix it with the regular contour I use. I think that looks 
pretty good. I'm just gonna blend it out with a brush. That just shows posting more. And then I'm gonna contour my cheeks with that as well. I'm gonna curl my eyelashes and then do my eyebrows. So I'll zoom in because I'm gonna start doing my eyes next. So I'm gonna lay the base of my eyebrows with the light eyebrow pencil and then I'm gonna add some black eyeshadow on top of it. Start on the eyes. I'm gonna use gel eyeliner today. This is the Anastasia one, and I'm just using a brush. I'm just gonna wing it to be honest. wings I'm gonna put powder under my eyes and then set the gel eyeliner with eyeshadow because it transfers a lot because of my eyelids so I'm gonna just put powder down so I can just wipe it away if like black eyeshadow falls black eyeliner to the waterline. Now I'm gonna smudge black eyeshadow on my waterline as well. For lips, I'm going to do black as well. I haven't done black lipstick in a while. Um, I'm going to use eyeshadow. I think that's it for makeup. I'm gonna try to do my hair now. Okay, I have this leather skirt that I chose out. I might change it later to a longer skirt, but I'm gonna put on some jewelry. I'm putting 
this bracelet on. And then I have to figure out what else I want to wear. So, hold. this is the outfit I have on right now. It's a long velvet skirt, this top, and then the fishnet top. I have a second choice outfit that I might want to wear. I haven't tried this on yet. Killstar sent me this. I'm just not like a huge fan of the high necks right now, so I don't think I'm gonna wear that. But they also sent me this shirt. It's a lace shirt and it's pretty cute. I just don't know if it would look good on me right now. Maybe we could try it on with a short skirt and see if that looks good. But this is the first option of what I might want to wear. Here's the second outfit. I wore this skirt in my last picture, so I don't think I can wear it again and if I'm going to post today. But I do have the leather skirt I can wear. I just don't know what shirt I'd want to pair it with if I'm going to wear the leather. I also have this dress from what I wore on my birthday. I don't know what I want to wear yet. Okay, then I have the dress and this lace covering. I think I'm going to just wear this for now. Um, and I'm not sure what shoes I want to wear yet, but once I decide, I will show you. I'm going to show you my outfit once I'm out and about because it's kind of hard to show in my little tiny loft but um i think we're gonna go maybe downtown i want to take some pictures so i'm gonna find somewhere to take some pictures i'm just gonna take you throughout my day because i feel like this video is gonna be kind of short and boring because i didn't really interact much while i was doing my makeup i was kind of just letting you watch so yeah i'm gonna take you throughout my day and we're gonna have an amazing world goth day